Hey guys, Tim Wilson UK here and uh, welcome back to the Golf Club 2. I'm going to be doing another match play round, I think. Um, I've just finished one and I've just finished a society round, just finished off this week's society event. So let's jump straight in. Now I'm going to, let's not go to all courses, let's go to friends played and let's see if anything, what? <laughs> Let's go friends courses. No results found. Are you kidding me? Ridiculous. There we go. Something's going to come up now. PGA National Champion. Empress Hills was recommended to me. So let's choose... Empress Hills. New round, firm, firm, fast. So this is going to be tough. Uh, let's choose match play. Let's add a player, ghost. And let's choose friends. And let's see what comes up. Wow, quite a lot. And I think uh, I'm going to think I'm going to play SMAC. And I think I think this gentleman's name is Simon, but I will call him SMAC just to make sure, but I'm pretty sure that's Simon. Um, in fact, I can check. Hold on one sec, guys. Because I'd like to call him by his name, if that is... I'm pretty sure that's him. Let's have a quick look. There's one way to make double sure. Friends... Search, SMAC, thirteen, fourteen. It might not be actually. Let's call him SMAC anyway. So SMAC 13, 14, we're going to be using your ghost ball. So let's add that ball to the group. Uh, and let's just change all the settings. Black T, seven and a half thousand yards. Wow. And let's play the pin, the same pin set, and let's begin the round. So I foresee that this is not going to be easy. Um, my record in the match play hasn't been great so far. Played four, drawn two, and lost two. So I've yet to win a match. <laughs> so it hasn't been uh, hasn't been all plain sailing. In fact, it's been absolutely dreadful. So let's see if we can uh, try and scrape a win here now. It is firm and fast, and it is all the things that make the golf club, the golf club too, really difficult. So let's see if we can put a round together here. Let's see what the wind's like for a start. Three mile an hour. That's not too bad, but a long, long par four to kick off here. Push that one ever so slightly. I say ever so slightly, I pushed it quite a lot, but the fairway is quite wide, so it's very, very forgiving. 300 yards, smack bang in the middle of the fairway. Well, I think I got away with that one. All right, let's see whether SMAC is wearing tartan gear. No, quite a conservative golf outfit there. Wow. He either had the wind behind him 
Or he just hit the ball an awful lot further than me. Holy crap. He's a long way down the fairway. Uh, 195. that to bounce up short ideally and then just roll onto the front just like that it shouldn't roll too much further because there's a bank there and that pins right in the front of the green and it's still going to give me a tough little putt coming back All right he's not going to have an awful long way to go there 128 so that should be that should stop pretty much dead I don't think that's going to be far away. Yeah, we're gonna, probably going to. I'm probably going to be further away than him, and his is still rolling. Let's see who's first. Right, it's me to putt first. Twenty-five for one eight seven. So these are brutal greens. These are the fastest they're going to get. Uh, that was that was what was known that is known as being really really hesitant Ooh, that was not a good putt to get things underway and he smashes it in first hole one up so i am carrying on where i left off early and that's just losing holes um So 397, I think, I, I wonder if we're playing off the same tee box. I'm pretty sure we are. No, we can't be. He had 397. I've got 478. No, he's playing off the. We're playing off different tees. Damn it! Let's get this started again. Let's get this started again. Sorry about that, guys. Um, we want friends played. Empress Hills. I thought he outdrove me by a long stretch on the first one. Play format. Match play, add player, add ghost. Let's choose the same one. Friends. Same one again, which was that one there, the seven under par. Okay, let's make sure we choose the same stuff now. Now he is on the white tees, that looks the same. Pin set three. Now we should be all good to go. I thought he outdrove me by way more than what he should have on the first hole. So this will be interesting now because I know that he birdies the first. So that, um, it does give it a little, give it away a little bit here guys. But, um, it just means I'm under incredible pressure here to try and get mine close on the second shot. Having not hit that particularly well. It's almost 300 and I know his is about 307 so I'll be playing mine first. My approach shot at least. And he took a 5 wood there. He must have had the wind behind. He couldn't have taken a five wood. There's no way he took a five wood there. 323. <laughs> All right, now let's try and get this close. Ha! 
Oh my god. Not great. Fast, perfect. Could do with that bouncing and just rolling a bit and stopping there. All right, so we got a chance at a birdie. I know he puts his relatively close, but he also drains an absolute peach of a putt. Um, so let's get this first hole out of the way. It bounces left and rolls off to the left a little bit. So it's gonna be him to putt first. When it eventually stops. All right, and he manages to drain this. There we go, an absolute great opening putt there. Now I've got this for the half. Okay, so we halved the first hole this time, but at least we're now playing off the same tees. Okay, let's jump straight into hole number two, all square after one. That's better, we're both standing on the same tee box now. Now I don't normally play off uh, shorter tees than the longest tees that are available, but I'm just playing a ghost ball. So we go with what the ghost ball has left us with. That's a fairly decent strike. It's gonna leave us in the middle of the fairway. That'll do just shy of 300 yards. slow perfect there but I don't think it's going to give him too much of a headache I think he may even be playing with the tour clubs because he's out driving me by quite a long way all right we've got a hundred and seven yards here don't think the slope made a lot of difference, but it did a little bit. It went off to the left. All right, he's got 94 yards. Okay, so he's not on the green yet. Eight yards, can he chip this in? No, all right, so we've got an opportunity to try and win a hole here. It's moving quite a bit. Oh, it died at the end. It moved at the end, it started to turn, but not quite enough. All right, can he get this one in? Yep, he drains the par, so I need this one for the half. Get the half and we move on to hole number three. All right, what do we got here? 580, 575. And this is off this is off the white, so I hate to know what this would be off the blacks. That should straighten up quite nicely. Little bit of fade on it, but the wind should straighten it out. That should be absolutely bob on. Slow fast, so is that going to put him in the rough? I fear it is, and it's the heavy rough as well. So he's going to struggle on this hole, I think. So I need to try and capitalize here because I don't think he's going to be getting out of the rough. 
I think he's playing with the tour clubs because that said 217 for a three iron. Petulia, oh man, Empress Ills. This course kicked the crap of myself out of myself, Martin and Dwayne. Yeah, I am. When I saw that everything was fast here, um, it sent shivers down my spine. But um, it is a match play, so uh, I'm not too bothered about the stroke play score. I've just uh, got my fingers crossed that I can just keep it together. I haven't dropped a shot yet. And I put that in a good position. And my my uh, my opponent's playing his third now from 167. And to be fair, from where he was, that's not a bad shot at all. That's coming right round the back of the flag. Right, what do we got here? The greens are just so hard to stick like hitting concrete. Yeah, they're they're always, always tough when it's like this. 31. Uphill lie. I just don't want this to spin back off the green. Let's see what happens here. I don't mind going over the flag as long as it spins back a little. That's okay, that's my third. Looks like it's going to be downhill, which is going to be horrible. Let's see what he does with his. It's underneath the hole. And he's still running a long way away. So I've got a downhill putt here, which is going to be brutal. Let's see what it is. It's not too bad. It seems dead straight. So let's just try and trickle this down to the hole. That is going to be for the birdie and also to win the hole. So that is the first hole. Or that is the first time I've been up in 21 holes. Because I wasn't up at all in the last 18 holes that I played. So I'm pretty chuffed with that. It's uh, it's in the right direction. Let's put it this one. Okay, let's put it that this way. Let's see if I can actually try and hold a green here. I have got the uh, the seven or the eight iron out, one or the other. That's okay, guys. That's not too bad. I've held the green 153 yards, left myself about seven or eight feet, I think. He had a brutal 11 mile an hour win from right to left. So I have to give him credit if he gets this close. He has got it close. In fact, he's probably even got it closer than me. He's got seven feet. I reckon I've got about eight feet. I have, I've got eight feet. And in for the birdie. Wow, I needed that because I feel that he's going to get that. At seven feet, I feel that he's going to get this. He did get it. Wow, I needed to get that. I really needed to get that. All right, still one up. This course is really, really tough. Right, what have we got here? We've got 424 yards. Why on earth would I take a five wood there? Got a little bit of stutter there. That wind should help that slight fade just to bring it round into the middle of the fairway. Yep, there we go. Should stay on a fairly flat section of the fairway. Yeah, it's not selecting the right club for him. It said 217 and that's definitely a driver. So 
but I definitely think he's using the tour clubs but it's uh, it's difficult to tell at the minute because um, it's not showing the right club selection on the screen for him all right 119 123 into the wind Has it got the legs? It has got the legs. In fact, it's a little too strong, but it's okay. I will take that. On these firm and fast greens, I will take that any day of the week. And he's come up short. So again, unless he can get this in, unless he can chip this in, I have another opportunity here. Again he hits the flag, that's the second time he's hit the flag. Right, so let's see if we can capitalise here. It's a tough putt, tough putt, swing in, downhill. Yes, two up. Yes, two up. Okay, I remember being four up against Rich LP though and still fin finishing all square, so I'm not counting my chickens just yet. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? Where's the fairway going here? What the actual hell? Where's the fairway? Where is the fairway? Okay, this is one of those sort of uh, ones where you have to play up short. Hit that nice and straight. Let's hope it stays on that upper level and doesn't roll round to the left. It is going to the left. Is it going to slow? Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that all day long. Let's see what club he's showing now. See, that's showing a 5 iron at 192. Well, he's clearly not hitting with a 5 iron. I'm almost certain he's playing with the tour clubs, otherwise I don't think he would have attempted that. All right, I'm gonna be way, way further back here. We're in the fairway. It's moving off to the left and it's on an uphill lie. So 109, 114, Let's see where we end up. Oh, that could be good. Yes! Yes! I was going to say it sounded good. Has he come up a bit short? No, that's rolling up beautifully. Alright, I think he's just put that inside of my ball. No, not quite. Seven feet is a good opportunity. He's in. He's in. Alright, so that means it puts me under the pressure that uh, to convert here. Four feet. Yep. Half the hole still remain two up. Right, just blue at the minute, all blue on the scorecard. Look at this for a hole. Wow. A 120, playing 121 into the wind. Let's see if I can do what I did a few minutes ago with the same club. I've hit it nicely again. I just need to hope that it's got the legs. It's long. It's long. And I'm I'm thinking that's going to give me a downhill putt. All right, so he had an 11 mile an hour wind behind. So, but he's played a better shot than me, has he? Oh, about the same. 
about the same, the same. I could have done with him being a little bit further so I could get a good read off of his putt. But I've got a feeling that's just going to start turning towards the end. Now. Oh, it turned too much. Oh, that was close. Let's see if he can do a better job than I did. He's moved it over. He's done the same thing. He's done the same thing as me. He hasn't gone that far past though. We did exactly the same thing and I probably would have got a good read off of his if he was a little further away. But um, he didn't have the benefit of seeing mine moving over. All right, so managed to pick up the par. Let's see if he does the same thing. I would imagine from about four feet, he's not gonna miss that. No, nope. in for par and we move on to hole number eight. Cheers, Matt. I've just seen your comment saying fantastic shot. Thanks very much. All right, what do we got here? Par five. All right. Always a good birdie opportunity. Wow, look at the glitches there. We need to try and get it over these bunkers. Should be able to get it way over there. Which way do I want to go, though? Let's go this way. Ah, I just got to hope that doesn't bounce into the rough. Slow down now. No, no, no. That's exactly what I didn't want to happen. Damn it. like he's hit a beauty it may uh supremish i am using the player clubs yes all right so he's further away but he's in the fairway which is going to be good for him and he's hit a cracking shot into that green He's on the upper level though. I don't even know whether I'm going to be able to get to the green from this rough. Yeah, look at that lie. Yeah, that is that was always going to be horrible. Supremish, wherever I try them, my shots go to the right, even though the indicator shows that I hit the straight shot. Yeah, I'm not overly, um, I'm not overly confident with them just yet, so um, I just leave them in the bag. Oh my God! Perfect fast with a flop shot, and it's like hitting it right in the teeth. So that is going to be a hole gone guys i have just played this all to crap rough bunker and in the teeth so absolutely terrible am i on the green i'm on the green and it's giving me a chip shot i'm not going to chip i'm sorry 24 yards multiply that by 3 72 feet Downhill. Yeah, it's probably not going to hold the green. No. That is very odd to be chipping there. Yeah, it's, um, it's weird, the dynamic in this. I think it's... Anywhere where the green grid is. Petulio, ha ha, you mean your name's not rich with a chip on the green. I, I just I just won't chip on the green. It's just not in my DNA to chip on the green. And I need to get this in. I, I think I need to get this in just for par. Yeah, I'll take that par. 
<laughs> so he's got, uh, he's on for two. He's got two putts to win the hole now. Let's see how much pace this shot's got. He could end up in the same position I was. So he's going to roll off as well. So he's got this chip to win the hole. He's going to putt it. Interesting. And he gets it. So he wins the hole. Nicely played. Nicely played. So back to one up. And we're on to the last hole on the front nine. 375. Oh, tiger line. Like it. That's a cracking drive. Is he going to hold the fairway, though? No, not quite. Mmm, that's going to be interesting. It's not a long hole. 375. Do we try and go big here? Is it going to come up short? Yes. Yes. Okay. So that worked out. And the thing is, is that that's where you, that's the, where you're playing second, you get the benefit of seeing where your opponent's ghost ball ends up. Um, and you work according to that. But that, from that yardage, was not the best of approach shots. What have I got here, though? One, one, three. Nice and straight. It may be a little big. Oh, no, it's not. Mine's also come up short. It's just rolled onto the green. I thought I was probably going to be long there. Let's see if he can pull a magic chip shot out. Is he going to hit the flag? He has hit the flag again, and it hasn't dropped. That's three times in this round he's hit the flag, so he's really good at the old chip shots, this old boy. See if we can get that shot back. Yes. Back to two up. So through nine holes, two up. All right, let's get this back nine done. Let's see if I can hold this together. Got the driver in my hand. Wasn't so great on the last par five. So let's see if I can keep this together now. The better one. JMO6316 Ice is back. <laughs> oh, don't roll into the rough. Are you kidding me? That's the second par five in a row that I've gone into the rough off the tee. Just makes the second shot so hard. He's going to be absolutely perfect again. Look at that. And it gets a cracking kick to the right. Definitely playing into... He's either playing with the tour clubs or he's got the, the wind behind. All right, so I've got 262. Now, the likelihood is, is that I'm not going to be getting to this green in two. So, I may play a bit smarter here and play out into this wider section of fairway. And leave myself a more calculated shot into the green. Yeah, there is definitely a big difference in the wind. Uh, Matt, I think these matches are great, Tim. Very fun to watch. They are fun when they're close. I, I, I haven't won one yet. You were the first one that kicked my butt when I, uh, when I played against your ghost ball. Look at this for a shot. Look at this for a shot. Wow. Okay, so he's there in two. 
I am still a hundred and something yards away, I would have thought. 89 yards. So I really have to get this close. Twenty one oh five. Okay. This is a pressure shot. This is a pressure shot. Oh, yes. Hell, yes. Oh, I needed that. Oh, is he going to come up with another one of his chip shots? And it's going, is it going to go in this time? He's hit the flag a few times. Ooh. So that's the thing. From 105 yards, I managed to get mine closer than his chip shot from six yards. It's bizarre. When the greens are this hard, it's so difficult. Even those chip shots are brutally difficult. All right, so we're halved in birdies, I think, there. Still two up, got eight to play. So all to play for, a lot of holes left to play here, guys. We've got a par three here, playing at 214 yards with the elevation change, 220. So let's have a quick look at the green, see if we're gonna be rolling up to the flag. We are rolling uphill to the flag. It's getting it up there though. That felt good, but I still think it's gonna be long. It is gonna be long. Yeah, and that's gonna, is it gonna roll down that slope? Yeah. Ah. At least it's rolled onto a flatter bit of ground, but look at that, 234 yards from a two iron at 216 where I even took a little bit off of it as well so let's see what he manages to do he gets a slow perfect he's drawing it into the flag that's a much better shot a much better shot and that is that puts me under an incredible amount of pressure because he's going to have a putt for a birdie there whereas I am nowhere near the flag problem with mine is is that if I go past, I'm going to be rolling down the hill now. So I've got to be a little bit careful about this. I need to, I think, try a flop shot here. Can it stop though? It has stopped. It's going to leave me a horrible putt. Oh, in for the par. So this is down to his putt for birdie, whether I actually lose the hole. He's missed it. And it's rolled on a fair stretch as well. Look at this, guys. He's still got 10 feet. He needs to try and save par now. He's got it. Halved in pars. What a hole. I wasn't in that after that drive. I'm so chuffed about that. All right, par four, 384 yards. Let's have a look down the fairway, see where we're going. Don't think that drive is going to be too long. It is going to be too long. You know, it's 384 yards. I think even the three wood's going to be too long. I'm going to play conservatively here. I think the five wood is probably a better option because we are going to go off to the right. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. At least I'm going to have... What am I going to have? 
100 and something yards? What is it to the flag? Let's have a look. 361. I'm going to have about 120 to the flag, something like that. He played an iron, but we don't know what kind of wind he had. He also played very, very conservatively there. Not going to be a million miles away from me. He probably played something like a two or a three iron there. Let's see what his approach is like. Massive difference in wind. Huge difference. That's a great shot. Little long. It's going to give him a horrible putt. Look at this green. It's like that all the way. Right, I want to be coming in with a wedge here. What have we got? An eight iron. It's one four five. I thought it was a lot less than that. Have I got the legs? I think I'm going to come up a bit short here. I am short. Ouch. Does anyone have a glitch where the yardage to the hole is giving a range? Example 220 to 240s. No, I haven't had that. that that's a tough one, that is, because that is playing a lot harder. 15 yards. might happen but it stopped so I'm thankful for that that's a horrible putt he's played it well though he's played it very well he's left himself seven feet shy but I'm a good way away yet I've got probably 10 12 feet here 11 feet I'm in for par, so he's got this to save the half. Which he's done. All right, we are pushing it, guys. We're pushing it all the way. Look at this, two up, and we've got six to play. Frodo Fox, good evening, fella. Um, I played your ghost ball earlier on, oh, what was the course called? I can't remember. I cannot remember, sorry. Um, what was that course called that I played earlier? I haven't played Devil's Gulch yet, no. Right, I need to check this out. Dovetail Park, thank you, thank you, Matt. And I have to tell you, you absolutely kicked my ass. We played match play and you beat me four up. I wasn't up at any point in the match, so um, you had an absolutely blinding round. Yeah, it's showing 279 here for his driver, so even though he's got uh, the brutal wins, he is playing with the tour clubs. But we both played really, really good drives there, considering the narrowness of that fairway. All right, what do we got here? We got 70 yards. Get in the hole. Ooh, that was close. That was close. Devil's Gulch is awful, Tim. We played it as a random course on Dwayne's stream. Absolute garbage. Is that the Mickey Mouse one? Is that the Mickey Mouse one that you were talking about earlier or somebody was talking about earlier where 
Um, George shot 14 under. Yeah, if it's a Mickey Mouse course, I don't play Mickey Mouse courses, I'm afraid. All right, so this is this is a clutch putt, guys, because this is nine feet. It's moving out quite a bit. And I feel like I need to get this just to hold the half. All right, so he needs to get this for the half now. Oh, he's missed it. Three up. Nice. Right, three up with five to play. I may, may actually win a round. I may actually win a match here, guys. This will be a first. If I win this one, this will be my first match play win. Two losses, two draws, but in the driving seat at the moment. I need a good bounce here. Just like that. Just like that. Um, I haven't been on holiday yet. Um, I went away for the weekend. I haven't been on holiday yet. It's, uh, it's coming up very, very shortly. And I can't wait. Wow, he's hit that a long way. And it's come around nicely off that fairway. I don't think I've dropped a shot on Empress Hills yet. That is the Wilson bounce in all its glory. All its glory. Um, Palmer and Bennett, no, I, I'm going to Crete. I haven't been to Crete before, so I'm heading off to Crete. Look at that shot. Seven feet from the flag. Man, talk about putting me under pressure. 157 yards and I need to try and get it inside seven feet anything right is just gone and that is my problem I play everything to the right I would rather play this further left it's gonna come up short it's going to come up way short. Forty-three feet. Talk about leaving myself a mountain to climb. It's not getting it there. It's getting it to slow down once it gets there. Because look at this. It's now rolled on a good... That's rolled on almost 10 feet past the flag. I'm still going to be putting here. I picked up the par, but I feel that he's going to have about 8 feet for the win. Yes, he wins the hole. Uh, Groundzilla, yesterday I hit a 7 iron from 148, hit the whole flag, sat 2 feet from the hole. <laughs> Oh, real life. Nice. Um, oh, unlucky fella that you didn't get the hole in one. All right, so we're back to two up. We've only got four to play. He's now got the honour. So let's see what happens here. This is a short par four, but really, really difficult. Is he going to get the bounce? He is going to get the bounce, and it's checked up. Is he going to hold the green? That is a cracking shot. Uh, when we played this course, we were playing two teams doing sort of a four ball. Great fun. Yeah, they're always really good fun when you do um, when you do team games. Two five nine seven feet up. I feel that I need to play the three wood here and try and slam it into that bank. Like that. How 
far is it going to roll? That's not too bad. That's a green in one on a par four. Is it going to hold the green? It's not quite stopped yet. I think he's going to be playing first. Yet yeah, he's putting from 35 feet. Not a lot of movement in this. It's going left, right, left, right. Question is, can he get it to stop? Again, you see that, guys. It's always difficult to get the ball to stop. That may even roll, trickle off the green. Getting it to the hole on the fast greens is never a problem. It's getting it to stop when it gets to the hole. I think I'm going to have a really tricky putt here. It's moving both ways, which normally suggests to me, hit it dead straight. I haven't hit that one too hard. It should start coming back round to the right. That's going to leave me a cert of a birdie. It's whether he can get his birdie here now. If he misses this, it's probably... No, great putt. Great putt for the all square. Okay, so... Two up with three to play. Par four, par three, par four. He still got the honor because we halved the last hole. Again, not a long hole, 383, sub 400 yards. He gets a slow perfect. Again, we're gonna be playing across the fairway here, but it looks like there's quite a big mound there, so that should slow the ball up which, as you can see, has done exactly that. Let's swing this round just like he did. There we go. Wow, it gave me a red driver there. I don't have a red driver in my bag. It's a little glitchy this evening, if I'm honest, guys. That's not too bad. We're up on the top of the slope. It's going to be him to play first. We're not going to have much more than, I was going to say, much more than 120. He's got 130 to the flag. Looks like the wind's pulled that round to the left a little. It has, so that's going to be way short. Oh no, it's hit the slope as well. That could roll all the way back off the green. No, it stopped on the lower level. All right, what have I got? 120, 122, 125. With the wind behind, that should be absolutely spot on. Bite, bite. Okay. This is the opportunity to close out the match. Sushi, well done. So my yardage to pin is jacked. I restarted the PlayStation and still have a glitch. I have to guess the yardage when it says I'm 120 to 140. That's bizarre. That really is bizarre. Okay, so this is for the match, guys. Yes, that's my first match play win. Five games played, five matches played. One match play win. Nice. I like that course though. That is a uh, that's a nice course. I'm going to give that four stars. I'm going to favourite that. I'd like to thank everybody that's been watching this on Twitch. Everybody that's tuned in. Thank you very very much. If you've been watching this on YouTube, 
give it a thumbs up if you've enjoyed the video. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, the subscription button should be over there. And if you check the little bell icon next to it, you will get notified when new videos get posted online. If you'd like to leave a comment, pop them in the box somewhere down below here. And until next time, guys, I've been Tim Wilson UK. This has been the Golf Club 2. Take care. See you soon. Bye now.